You got waiters, housekeepers jumping out of bushes. Money! <laughs> Money! Money! Shut up! <laughs> another thing is, I'm an adult. I pay my taxes. I'm a grown man. There is no reason for another adult to look me in the face and say, washy washy. <laughs> First time I heard it, I thought, oh my God, my family has tricked me and sent me to a nursing home. So he said, washy washy. I was like, all right, get in there. Do what you gotta do. I, uh, I... Oh, my hands. Okay, cool. 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 Another thing I have a problem with, I, uh, I have to say this, uh, a lot of kids on the ship, a lot of kids, if, you, if it was half that many kids, it'd still be too many kids on the ship. Uh, for you uh, parents, the, the, oh, oh no, no, for the kids, for the kids in the audience, just want to let you know a little secret, a little secret, something you should know and think about. Mommy and daddy love you very much. Just want to say that. Your parents and your family love you very much. The rest of us, <laughs> we'd be a lot happier if you were at home. And I shouldn't blame the kids, it's the parents. Some, some parents are great on land, and they're crap on a ship. You see them on land, you see them on the first day of the cruise. You're like, oh, that's a, is this your family? The beautiful family. Yes, this is my family, this is my husband. And oh, Timmy, 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 don't walk away. Stay with mommy. This is Timmy. This is Timmy here. Don't leave mommy's side, okay? And this is our family. Then, then three days, three hours later, you see them in the casino. See the same woman in the casino. You're like, hey, how you doing? Oh, I'm doing great. And where's your son? I'm like, I, I don't know. <laughs> then you ask him, like, aren't you worried about him? They always say the same thing. Where is he going to go? <laughs> well, I don't know. There's a dark body of water surrounding us. I, I... <laughs> One more thing that annoys me, the announcements. I don't understand the announcements half the time. Maybe it's where my room is. All I hear is... Now, I can't <laughs> I hear an announcement I don't understand, I put on my life vest and head down to customer service. Hey, 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 is there something I need to know? Okay. I hear two announcements I don't understand, I just pack my stuff and get in a lifeboat. Yeah, something goes down, you pull off the tarp on that lifeboat, I'll be inside with all my stuff going, shotgun! The only announcement I do hear every day is the captain's. It's like he wakes up each morning and tries to be sexier. Hello, I'm your captain. How are you? I'm your captain. Then he tries to make me feel stupid. We are at uh, 27 nautical miles from the 249 latitude and the 560. I don't understand any of that. Somebody send a letter to the captain. Tell him I went to elementary school and a public school and uh, just say miles. It's nautical miles and latitude and longitude. He should just come on and go, hello people, we're 45 minutes from Cuba and two and a half hours from the Bahamas. <laughs> and of course, the one thing that, that proves to me that there are bad parents on this ship, the very first day. Very first day of the cruise. People trying to enjoy themselves. I want a cruise! Yeah, it's 40 degrees. You out there with a jacket? It's Smoking section. Oh yeah, we on vacation. Everybody wrapped in coats, wearing gloves, hats. Where are the kids? In the pool. <laughs> Jumping around with the ice cubes. Woo! That's the thing. They can jump into a cold pool. That's what kids just remind you how old you are. Kids can do stuff I can't do anymore. Sometimes I drop stuff and decide whether or not to pick it up. Like, no, that's, I can get another watch. <laughs> I can't get another set of knees. That's gonna hurt right there. A lot of stuff I hated as a kid, I love now. Taking a nap. Oh my God, I used to, I used to scream and shout. I don't want to take a nap! Now, well you tell me I got an hour and 30 minutes with nothing to do? I'm like, ooh, ooh. I know what I'm doing. That is a little spa day right there. It's like when you're just trying to take a poo. Ooh. As a kid, that was drama. I don't want to go to the bathroom. Now, oh my God, I have a little rumble right here. 
<laughs> you know you old when they have like, ooh, rumble, rumble. Ooh, where's my iPad? <laughs> I'm going to the guest bathroom. <laughs> With that limited edition for Breeze, yeah. And I'm playing some Candy Crush for two hours. <laughs> That's embarrassing. That's what shows you you're old. Sitting on the toilet playing Candy Crush for two hours. <laughs> then the whole side of your body falls asleep. <laughs> yeah, you just walking out of the bathroom like you're coming back from war. <laughs> 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 What's wrong with you? I should have got up. I should have put more pressure on my left cheek. <laughs> ships a lot. I've been doing ships a while. I will say this, uh, sometimes I'll do a show and an entire family will get up and walk out. The whole family gets up, walks out. And I think to myself, oh my god, did I offend them? Only later to find out, they speak Spanish. Yeah, that's a little evil, isn't it? Yeah, she did it to me like two months ago. My phone rang, I saw it was her, I knew it was trouble. I picked up the phone and we found out my grandfather has Alzheimer's disease. And the whole family is pretty upset because we heard it might be hereditary and all. I'll tell you something else, not me on my butt. Still not over this, just found this out. Just found out my uh, grandfather has Alzheimer's disease. And the whole family is a little upset because we heard it. Oh. No, he's repeating it because Alzheimer's means that. You know, people, um, you come on this ship, you, you look around and you think, man, it's got a bit of a wow factor. And you go, wow, there, there are cheaper cruise ships out there, so these people must have nice jobs, must be well-educated, and then you stand on the stage and start telling jokes and you realize, mm. <laughs> no, there's some scratch-off winners in here. Some... <laughs> Baby, we going on a cruise! <laughs> you're, an, you're an amazing group of people. Sometimes I look at you all and I think, man, where's a torpedo? Uh, <laughs> Oh, come on, this is an ugly stuff. Like five in the morning, putting your stuff out on a chair so nobody else can have it. <laughs> five in the morning, put your shades on this one. I'll put some encyclopedias on that one. I'll put a book on that one. I'll put my baby on that one. <laughs> five in the morning. I see, uh, I love how people take food to their cabin. Don't quite understand that. Waiters come out, they're just putting out dishes. <laughs> okay, all right. You know that you can eat anytime you want. It's a cruise ship. Eat wherever you want. The worst is the wind jammer. I mean, you got that guy just looking at the food and he's not carrying a plate. <laughs> like he's looking at emeralds. The rest of us are hungry. Stupid. Anyway, I just want to say this. My favorite day of the cruise is tomorrow. Tomorrow's my favorite day of the cruise. Hands down, that's the day I'm most entertained. I like to take a folding chair and go sit by customer service and watch people show up with their bill. Uh, people start losing their mind. Hey, this didn't make any sense. I can't drink that much alcohol. This is, I did not spend that much money. And who is gratuity? Why is he on here? I don't know. I need drinking more than I am. Drinking $16 a day. What is he doing? Well, they do something special here at Royal. They put Buddhists and Hindus on the front desk. You can't upset a, bit, a Buddhist. You try your best. People show up with their bill. What is wrong with my bill? This is wrong. What is wrong with my bill? Don't worry, sir. We will find out what is wrong with your bill. You want your vacation to be perfect. <laughs> what seems to be the problem? Well, I'll tell you what the problem is. I don't understand anything on this bill. It doesn't make any sense at all. What is, what is, like, like this, what is this? Carpet tax. What is carpet tax? Well, sir, nothing to worry. We will find out, okay? Let's see. Carpet tax, carpet tax, carpet tax, carpet tax, carpet tax, carpet tax. Ah! Carpet tax. Sir, did you walk on the carpet? <laughs> did you have to pay? Is your carpet tax? 
Some people lose their mind. I'm not going to pay. They go, oh, sir. Everybody pay. <laughs> Try to get off the ship if you want to. You'll get home, there'll be a Royal Caribbean truck outside your house loading up your flat screens. <laughs> what is going on out here? I told you, everybody pays. Washy, washy. <laughs> So, right now, I'm going to do my world-famous impression. Right now, world-famous impressions, you won't see anywhere else in the world. People come from miles around. You see me, people will come from other ships. Uh, this is for you music fans. This is five-year-old Barry White and his father. Five-year-old music legend Barry White and his father. You guys do know who Barry White is, right? Just want to clarify that? All right, make sure for this one. Young people in the room right now, like you, sir, on the end, over there with that Led Zeppelin shirt. You know who Barry White is? You know who Barry White is? Yeah. Can you name a song? Barry White. Barry White. Yes, Barry White. No. How old are you? Don't mind me asking. 29. Yeah, you should know who Barry White is. If you're 29, there's a good chance he's the reason you're on this planet. <laughs> And if you get that joke, you don't know who Barry White is. He sings, he sings sexy music, sexy music. I hear it on the radio. I run home and take a pregnancy test. Uh, here we go. This is five-year-old Barry White and his father. Hey, Barry, what, what's wrong? Why are you crying? Why, why, are you, why are you crying? Oh, did you drop your ice cream cone? <laughs> Insane in the country. All right. Uh, I know how this works. Yeah. I, I act like an idiot up here, and if you laugh, I've done my job. If I don't laugh, I just look like an idiot. <laughs> but I, just, I understand how this works, you know. You're not getting paid to laugh, I'm getting paid to make you laugh. <laughs> <laughs> Did you think it was funny? Do you know who Barry White is? No. Do you know who Barry White is? Do you know who Barry White is? Okay. I'm sorry, people. I'm sorry. I'll be honest with you. I didn't feel like being very funny tonight. I didn't, I didn't feel like leaving my cabin. To be honest with you, I just... I just found out my uh, grandfather has Alzheimer's disease. <laughs> and the whole family were upset. What kind of sick people are poor? <laughs> they said it earlier, and that's what made that funny for people. And then they... <laughs> oh, you're some evil people. That's evil people. But I've had fun with you. I've had fun with you. It's, it's an evil ship. I think the ship's possessed. I don't know what it is. It's, it's, it's an evil ship. Evil. <clears throat> evil ship. Have you hit an elevator? Just hit a button for the elevator? And you could be waiting there and waiting there, just like, what? And then they're all over the place. And you're like, Doing what you do, you know, eating food, laughing, playing, peeing in the jacuzzi. I think to myself, it's those situations where I go, ooh, I'm pretty happy with my life decisions. Uh, I mean, they're beautiful, but they cost so much. So, yeah, I think 
kids are like classic cars. You know, she's just like, hey, I love it. You, you, you want to, does it drive? I don't know. I don't touch it. <laughs> By the way, nice shorts. Yeah, I wish they were a little looser. Um, <laughs> no, 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 that's fine. No, 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 God, don't adjust. Good boy. <laughs> You're already smuggling fruit. Let's not uh, just sit there with his legs like, ah! Like a used tea bag. Anyway, um, like a California raisin smiling at me. Can't do a show with you sitting there. Where are you from? California. California. Wow. He's one of them. <laughs> oh yeah, California oranges. Yeah. Uh, let me just say this. Uh, I, let me ask this question. How many people here from Florida? <laughs> Okay. Then you'll understand this. I still can't grasp this. How you can take a cruise ship from Miami and it takes off and you go, hey, who here is from Florida? And it's 98% of the audience. And then you have to ask them the same question everybody else asks them. Why are you on a cruise? You live five minutes from the beach. Why are you? You can drive to the beach. Why are you coming on a cruise? What? What? I just don't understand. I don't understand how the elevators move so fast and the people move so slow. <laughs> you ever been behind somebody in a hallway? Oh, 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 oh. It's like waiting for ice to melt. And the worst part is they have somebody with them, so they hold hands so you can't go around them. <laughs> You try to sneak, you can't because they got grandkids at the bottom as a border. <laughs> and today I saw something that, that reminded me why I don't have kids. I saw a kid running and the mom said, Back up! Back up! Back up! Back up! Back up! Back up! That kid did not care at all about <laughs> Becca, stop! <laughs> back up, back up, back up! You look at that little girl, she has a smile on her face, like, yeah, I can do whatever I want. My mom will never hit me in front of these many strangers. <laughs> so I will say this, uh, uh, five years ago, three years ago, about three years ago, three years ago, people were telling me that there weren't going to be any more cruises and nobody was going to travel anymore. Uh, so uh, I just want to thank you for coming back on cruises and uh, bringing this back. You've been a fantastic crowd. Thank you very much. My name is Louis Rainey. Enjoy.